Hi there. Today we are going to be doing an unboxing video for the Yamaha THR5A acoustic modeling amp. And the first thing that strikes me is that this box is small. It's tiny. Maybe like a foot tall. Two feet across. It's tiny. So let's open up and see what it is. How big it is. Go right in the top here and get your power adapter. Got a uh, USB cable to connect to the computer. Some sort of mini adapter. A instructions on README first. Please install Yamaha Steinberg USB driver before connecting THR to your computer via USB cable. Otherwise, THR may not function properly. To download the driver, go to download.yamaha.com. So that's how you install the driver. I'm not paid by Yamaha. I'm just, I'm just a guy who likes gadgets. This thing is tiny. And here we have a data packet, and it's a pretty thick manual, and it comes with uh, recording stuff software, Cubase IA6 by Steinberg, DVD-ROM. Then you got your pretty hefty uh, manual. It's in uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different languages. So, there you go. Now, this thing is just tiny, tiny, cute as hell. It's got a little handle on the top. It's light, it's tiny, it's got you get a mic modeler here for a condenser mic, dynamic mic, tube, nylon, or clean. Um, here's your on off switch on the top, nice toggle. You've got an auxiliary in, which is what, what that cable is for, a little mini, so you can connect an iPod and jam along. Headphones, your input. Um, you have your volume. This looks like delay and reverb. This is uh, other effects chorus. Looks like compressor clump. I'll have to look that up. Then you've got your basic um, blend master tone effect. Um, looks like it also has a tuner. So, on the back has your power cable uh, input and then a USB out. Note, there is no uh, direct out of this amp. So it's not going to be good for stage use. This is just tiny. It's 5 watts, basically. It'll also run on 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Eight AA batteries, which is cool. If you're a street performer, you need a little acoustic boost. This thing is real tiny and light. It's the size of a bread box, to be honest with you. I mean, you put it on this stool, and it and it's just tiny. So this is a good practice amp, most likely. Uh, you might be able to play a show with it if you liked it, I guess, but probably not so much. Um, I would say this is more of a tabletop uh, recording type amp. Uh, so we're going to do some sound tests with this and see how good it sounds um, with an acoustic uh, electric guitar and see if it fills up the room at 5 watts. Uh, this would be great if you're learning songs and you need to just plug something in quick and want to practice or for recording. I'm going to assume because it has the USB out, you can plug an input guitar and use it as a way to record your acoustic guitar direct. Uh, however, there is no... Um, external out in any way of the, from this little bread box Yamaha amp. However, I'm told it sounds good, so we're going to give that a try. So again, thanks for uh, watching, and by all means, please subscribe to our channel. 
Thanks.